If I were to encourage you to come to Wood Badge, I would tell you that it is a wonderful experience where you learn different facets of leadership, you learn all kinds of camaraderie, you learn to enjoy the diversity of each and every individual out there, the friendships that you develop through your wood badge experience will stay with you through your entire life. I'm fortunate enough to have friends that with uh, wood badge experience in the Northeast Georgia Council, in the Greater Alabama Council, and even nationally with my experience with the Philmont Leadership Challenge. Those friendships are priceless. So I would encourage you to take that step, take that leap, come along for the ride and enjoy both the practical lessons that you will learn as well as the new friendships, the new folks, the new uh, processes and information that you will glean. Make them come. What I tell people to make them come to Wood Badge is it is a wonderful opportunity for you to pretend to be a scout again because my scouts and Cub Scouts start at six years old. Boy Scouts are 11. Venturers are at 14. We get a wonderful opportunity to do some great training and start back at the beginning. And you know, quite often, a lot of my friends and I say, we're gonna make it to Eagle while we're at Wood Badge. Well, first of all, I want them to understand that uh, it's a training that is not like other training, that there are training they can take to know how to do their job in scouting. A cub leader can get training, a boy scout leader, but what this does is help them to do their job better from a leadership and management standpoint. But not only in scouting, but in their family, working with their family, working in their job. And the other thing I tell them that's different is you don't just take the training and stop. You have to prove that you learn uh, by completing uh, your goals and working toward your vision and those type of things that you don't do in another course. It's not you take your weekend of training and then you'll forget about it. You don't have to show that you've learned anything and this gives you an opportunity to show and experience the, the lessons you learn during the training. And I also uh, for myself and I tell them that uh, for those two weekends of training there's probably not another uh, training course where they'll learn so much in such a short period of time. It's intense, it's fun, uh, it's challenging, it's physically challenging but it, uh, I think it makes you a better person. When I talk to a scouter who has never attended Wood Badge, first I would tell them that Wood Badge is not a training course. I think calling it a training course is, doesn't give its justice. And I, would even, I usually tell them it's a life-changing experience that does teach you many skills to become a better leader, but it's so much more than that. Um, I also tell them too, to please ignore, dismiss anything you might have heard about Wood Badge. Uh, Wood Badge is a very emotionally charged uh, experience and there are a lot of good things and maybe not so good things that people feel during the course, which is all part of the learning process. And so I would tell these people, don't be, don't be scared of what you hear, don't, don't you know, pay too much attention to things that may not have gone just perfectly right, but, but look at the results. And I've seen some just life-changing results of scouters who have attended uh, Wood Badge. And I'm quick to point out that you know, within our district alone, we have several things that are ongoing programs for both youth and leaders that were as a result of, of these Wood Badge tickets. Uh, one of the which is a Cub Advancement Program that was done by two of our uh, adult leaders um, which has helped many Cub Scouts and Weeblaw Scouts earn many, many belt loops um, because of this Wood Badge ticket. Also, one of my Wood Badge tickets was to start the first OLS course that Shelby District ever had. Usually, in previous years, um, leaders had to go to other districts to get their OLS training. And um, so, since that time, we've had a number of adult leaders in Shelby Districts that uh, have been able to participate in OLS right in Shelby District. Mm -hmm.